Hey guys, so it is Halloween for me right now. It's not going to be Halloween when I upload this. For one thing, I normally don't get videos uploaded in a day, especially since it's like later in the day. But also, I'm uploading a bunch of videos right now for my fall break trip. So I'm making sure I get all those uploaded before I worry about this. But I wanted to record in my costume for my October wrap up because it just kind of made sense since Halloween's the last day of October. So I decided to record it today even though I'm not going to upload it for probably like five days or whatever. But just for the record, it was Halloween when I was wearing this. So that's why I have my Minnie Mouse costume on. So I didn't read a lot this month and that's because I had... Um, end of the quarter test and I had tons to study for. I had tons of like work and stuff the teachers were doing last minute. So I didn't have a lot of time to read then and then we had fall break and as many of you know by the time this video is posted all my videos that's part one through three of my trip to Tennessee and I didn't read it all on my trip so they only left like a very small amount of October for reading so I only read three books this month this month but I have very good excuses in my opinion. Maybe not really, but in my opinion, they're good excuses. Another thing I didn't accomplish this month was I said I was going to re not read. I was going to watch scary movies, go to haunted houses, all of this stuff, and I never did any of it. The only thing Halloween related I did was decorate and carve pumpkins, which isn't anything scary, but apparently I'm just a chicken now. So that failed just like my reading this month. So this wrap up, I'm not very proud of. Anyway, let's get into the books. The first book I read this month was The School for Good and Evil, Quest for Glory by Soman Chinami. And, and that's another excuse I have for not reading this much. The School for Good and Evil books are normally humongous, so I had to spend a lot of my month reading this because it took a while. And I'm not going to talk much about this because I did a vlog of me reading it, and I also did a full-on review. So I first did a non-spoiler one and then I did a spoiler one so if you guys want to go check out those videos go ahead. All I'm going to say in this since I already dedicated two full videos to this book I'm not going to say much I'm just going to say it was really really good this is my favorite series ever I love it so much and yeah it's just really good and you guys should read the series if you haven't and obviously I rated this five out of five stars. Next book I read this month month was Unhinged by A.G. Howard and it's the second book in the Splintered series and I'm really enjoying this series a lot. Um, I really love the main character Alyssa like I don't know I for I was literally in my school bathroom and looked in the mirror and it's like thought that something was gonna happen like in this book or the stuff that happens with her like with mirrors and stuff like I'm like I'm gonna walk to this mirror because I meant to be Alyssa, but we all know that's actually not going to happen. I wish it would, but I got to be real with myself. It's not. Another weird thing I have fallen in love with in this series is the love triangle, which sometimes love triangles can be annoying and cheesy. I mean, they're always cheesy, but like sometimes they're annoying, but this one's adorable and I'm obsessed with it. And yeah, it's really good, this series so far, and I rated it five out of five stars. The last book I read this October was Goosebumps. It came from Beneath the Sink by R.L. Stein, and these were my childhood like I this is one of my favorite series. I read most of the Goosebumps book in fourth grade like that's what I read in fourth grade and it was I read this yesterday. It was the day before Halloween. I don't have many spooky books and I knew I could finish this in a day and put me in the Halloween mood so I picked this up and I read it last night and finished it. I didn't have a lot of homework so I'm like you know what I'm gonna read this Goosebumps book since it's the day before Halloween and it really took me back it was really weird like when i was younger it would have taken me like a week to finish this and it finished took me like an hour and a half maybe probably not even that but yeah it was really nice to go back to my childhood of goosebumps because i really enjoyed them as a 10 year old in the fourth grade but anyways i rated this four out of five stars that is sadly all for this month because like i said I have not read that much this month, but the book I'm currently reading is on uh, in Snard. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Sorry if I just butchered that, but it's by A.G. 
Howard, and it is the third book of the Splintered series, and I'm on page... I'm just gonna look, because I did not look before, 126, so I'm not really that close to being done, but I have been reading it for a little bit, and I'm not listening to any audiobooks right now. Um, I am kind of listening to Alice in Wonderland. I started, but I got it on this free app, and it kind of messes up sometimes. And I've just been in the mood. If I want to read, I pick up a physical book. I don't. I haven't been really in the mood to listen to audiobooks. I don't know why. I've just when I feel like reading, I want to read like a physical book for some reason. So yeah, I guess you could kind of say I'm currently listening to Alice in Wonderland, but not really because the last time I listened to it, it was like three weeks ago, and I only listened to like the first 12 minutes of it. So. I don't think that really counts. Brings us to the end of this video. I hope everybody had a wonderful October and November is even better for everybody. And make sure to check out my social medias in the description box below to keep up with my life. And make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell so you can catch when all my videos are because I have absolutely no schedule. Sometimes I'll upload three videos in one week. Sometimes I'll skip a week. Like, I have no pattern. But I normally do upload at least once a week. But who knows? So make sure you click the notification bell. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!